Gentlemen, welcome back to the shop today. We're going to have a gander at these snap-on batteries. They've got to be the best in the business because they're the most expensive. That's just science. I don't mind to telling you. Actually, I do mind to tell you. A little bit humiliated at spending 540 of my Fiat printed, Fiat government printed beer tokens on that fap off tool. What ain't... <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Well, it ain't particularly good. However, I do love the, the, the sander, that is. I do really love that ratchet. Problem is, I haven't been able to find it since the Duclaw been here. Keep your frenemies close and your Duclaws closer. A right. little bit of adhesive or something in there. I do find these go real heavy into the tool. They're real toyed in the tool, and then trying to get them out is kind of a pain in the can't. I might just have to uh, fucculate one for the team. Yeah, that's adhesive in there. One thing that streaks you as odd is how many terminals are on this battery, but I think there's some redundancy in there. If you have a look, we got plus, minus, and some, some balancing lines, and then a neutral. That might be a temperature sense. Hard to say, but the really odd thing is that this is rated at 14.4 volts, which is this, the, the old NICAD rating, but there's, there's got to be two, three batteries in here, 18650 lithium cells, and any other company that's got three batteries calls it a 12 volt tool. So where are they getting the extra voltage? Maybe. That's the max possible volt. I doubt it'd be sitting at 14.4, however. Or maybe the double terminals are, oh yeah, it's dual voltage. It's dual voltage. Aha. Okay, so if it's dual voltage, that means that there is some weird switchery going on. Hmm, it'd be interesting to get in there and see. Yeah, that guy sitting at eight volts. Those two sitting at eight volts, and these two sitting at eight volts. So where are they getting 12 volts from? What the fuck over? This is weird. <laughs> so let's get in there. Good thing I got the carbide. Lots of glass fiber in this plastic. And not to worry, cut towards your chum, not your thumb. Because I'm wearing the latest in men's fashion, I get expedited delivery to the local hospital, universal health care, and so forth. Also, when you're dressed this fine, they give you a complimentary Noxalone shot. Fangies. I think I see what makes these so special. There's three 18650 cells, or four. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. There's four 18650 cells in each of these batteries. So what do you think are the odds of this going back together? Slim to nil. <laughs> Fuck it, we're, we're going in. Thank a patron, we're tucking into the beer fund here. Thank God it's not my money. Your money. Ah. Ah. Oh, well, that wasn't so hard. Just had to. Give her a little grunt. I'm not seeing any control circuitry on here. Oh, it's in the middle of the, okay, cool. Cool, there is some protection built into the battery. The board is very, like it's in there tight. All the components are very well packed in there. INR, these are Samsung if I'm not mistaken. I'm not sure what you do is you put that in the battery mooch gargler and it pops out all the info you want. So we'll go and take that number, INR18650, that's just the side, 25R, and we'll jam that in, see what uh, the mooch tells us. Sleazy as that, as of 2017, 2018, I'm, I'm parachuting here. Uh, he says that this is the best battery under 20 amp uh, continuous duty rating output, and it's 2,500 milliamp hours, so there's no dickery going on with the uh, watt hours or the nothing like that there's there's no chicanery happening what you see is what you get and good quality batteries all of the connections are good there's four stamps in here 
this is actually this is a great battery very well built uh, tight in there all kinds of elastic it's got protection built in it's got the extra cell you don't get with the the typical prosumer tools milwaukee makes a fine battery as well this costs 120 uh, kanaki stand kopecks off the truck uh, you probably get it down in the states for i don't i'm guessing like 80 something like that but you do get the extra battery so you get that much more performance that's 25 percent more however uh no, sometimes you, this this one's not like yeah you're paying more but that's okay in this case because you are getting more but in the case yeah I, I like i say i don't mind paying more but just just don't make me smile like a donut this this fucking thing just the mind boggles at uh how ripped up i got on, on that one okay snap on batteries not too big pretty good in fact, thanks for watching. Keep your dick in the face. Duclaw, buddy old pal. I take that back. Turns out it was right where I left it. I want to see if I can salvage this. Hopefully it still works if it fits in there proper. Also, i got to have this apart. Maybe they sell you, like these things are super well built. And they get you on the batteries and then they whop it to you on the high. I know. It's a fucking, it's a disease. Snap-on only beats me when I deserve it. Just like my daddy. <laughs> Fuck. Right on. Well, it didn't. at least I didn't waste. Ah, still good. Okay, we're going to have this A part too. This, I think... <laughs> oh, God. I think I didn't get too ripped off on this one. 